Alright, so here we are, finally, Green Mountain. Now, I'm, I've come here to buy a primary rifle, but I'm not sure exactly what I want. I think I might go for a bolt-action sniper, like the Lee Enfield. I'm not exactly sure, though, because I know the Lee Enfield can take a hunting scope, or is it the Mosin L LRS? I think it's the Mosin LRS. Alright, let's have a look, then. Um... Yeah, there has been a load of new guns added to the server. There's now like 40 custom guns. Um, I don't really want a sniper rifle per se. Not bothered about assault rifles. Mm, no. Um, shotguns, definitely not. Single barrel rifles, that might be... Oh, Lee Enfield. I think I'm going to go for the Lee Enfield. Alright, so there was an announcement in the uh, chat saying that there's going to be a helicopter crash on the Northwest Airfield. So I made my way up to the Northwest Airfield and I'm. Okay, there's a guy in there. And I'm waiting for the helicopter crash because pretty much one of the new guns only really spawns at helicopter crashes. And I want it. I badly want this gun. So I don't really want to kill this guy. If he buggers off and doesn't try and kill me. Yeah, if he buggers off and doesn't try and kill me... Oh, fuck, the helicopter crash is literally right there. I'm going to have to take this guy out if he goes for the helicopter crash. If he leaves it alone, then I'll leave him go. But if he goes for the helicopter crash, then I'm going to have to take him out. Alright, he's going for the crash. I'm going to have to take him out. <laughs> Holy shit, he just took a 303 shot to the... He There's fucking two of them. I was expecting to keep moving, not stop. There we go. Right, he's down. Where's his friend? Hmm. What? He's running. Is he trying to flank or is he running off? He's just taken one shot to the leg. That was the same guy that took a shot to the chest. Where the fuck has he got? Oh. Yeah. Oh, that's the third shot that's hit him. Jesus Christ. Maybe the 303 rounds that Lee Enfield takes aren't any good. That's the fourth shot. Jesus Christ. This guy's a tank. Where's he gone? I think he's in the bushes here. I can't see him. Where is... Ah, oh, yeah, there he is. You know what? He's running off. I don't think I'm going to try and kill him. Judging by their movement, they're both new to the game. They don't. They had no clue what was going on. I could have killed him easy there, but I'm going to leave him go as long as he doesn't come back. Because he's left the helicopter crash site and that's all I'm bothered about. So, yeah. Uh, we're going to make our way down to the crash. Right, since I didn't want to kill him, I'm just going to drag his loot off in case his friend comes back and takes it. Because I'm not bothered about the loot or the kill, it's just because he went for the helicopter crash site. So his friend can come back and get it. And this helicopter crash didn't have what I wanted anyway. I'm not even going to bother. Alright, it looks like his friend's come back. Because uh, his friend's come back pretty much naked so he can take all of his friend's stuff. So I'm going to try and help this guy get his friend's stuff. Yeah, you can tell these guys are new. He has no clue what's going on. I've literally just been sat here sniping the zombies around him. And he's not doing anything. I don't think he has a fucking clue what's going on. He probably doesn't even have a headset. Or... I reckon he has no clue at all what's going on. No, completely oblivious. Yeah, he's bandaging in the middle of the open when a sniper rifle's going off and zombies are everywhere. I don't think he has a clue what's going on. I'm gonna go down. I'm gonna go down and try and help him. I think he might need a IV or something. Well, literally just watched him go unconscious there. So I'm going to give him an IV. Hopefully he doesn't try and kill me when he sees me. Oh, he's awake. <laughs> Hello? No? Right, well we've come up to the um, military 
barracks on the very side of the map. Because uh, this is another place that a helicopter crash can actually spawn. It's quite common as well on, on my server. So it's possible that a helicopter crash could be here. I'm just going to check the barracks though. There doesn't seem to be anything in the barracks of use to me. I can hear an aggroed zombie out there somewhere, but I'm not sure exactly where it is. It sounds like it's attacking someone. Or something. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. Well, I'm not sure if this guy's going to make it or not. He looks like he's pretty fucking dead, but... I'm pretty sure what he did is he might have seen me in the barrack and gone to run away and ran literally off the rocks and killed himself. I think he probably wasn't looking where he's going and just killed himself. So I am bleeding as well from dropping off that rock. So I'm going to try and sort him out first. I'm not bleeding though. I'm just low on health because of the fall. So. Welcome back. Thank you very much, your gentleman. I actually seen you on the thought of his data. I haven't even a gun on me. It's I've a, Colin. I've a hand, a hand pistol on me for shooting zombies. I don't think and he you've just saved me. my life. Thank you very much. <laughs> Good to meet you again, Colin. It's Milo. Milo, I don't believe it. Milo, <laughs> will you pick? Will you? Uh, <laughs> I do believe it. I can't believe I knew you were on, but I didn't know that uh, you were in the game. I thought you were work working on it. That's why I didn't. Uh, I sent you a message this morning, but I didn't want to disturb you, you know. Oh, yeah, I've got uh, my notifications off, so I probably didn't see it yet, mate. Oh, not a problem. Don't worry, it's not a problem. Uh, um, it's, uh, I knew, I knew you, had been, you had been very busy, you know, and... Uh, I knew the server, the way the server was, just so you, you had problems, so... Really great to be back, though. Really good. C come with me, I've got a gun for you, mate. Your chap, your... Do you give me too much to you, do you? Where are you up above? Just up here, mate. Yeah, I'm just uh, under a bit of pressure here with Phil. I seen you and I took off. <laughs> I seen you and I took off down the hill, and it ended up it was a large jump. Oh, thank you. This M4, mate. Yeah. Don't take it yet. There's a uh, conversion kit for it, and it turns it to a 762. Right. Milo, you're like a guardian angel. That was unbelievable. <laughs> uh, I, I yeah, mean, I can hear I mean, a zombie aggro, and I thought it was attacking, like, wolves yeah, well, or a player. And I came down and just saw you lying there. Yeah, well, what, what I was doing was, uh, I'm so close to, to where I'm going to build the base again. And, and I'm back to the same spot. Hopefully there's nobody in it. And what I was doing was, hear me, I'll take a wee quick run up and see if there's a tent. If I have a tent, I'll be able to put the stuff. I bought, I've been to Green Mountain and bought a lot of stuff for um, for the building. And I, I, I hadn't even enough money left to buy, to buy a weapon. Here's me. I'll see if I can get a weapon and a tent. If I can get a tent here, I'll walk down with it. But I didn't get that far as you see. <laughs> <laughs> so can uh, I lift this now then? Uh, yeah, 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 mate. It's all yours. It's all yours. There's a bunch of mags on the floor as well. Well, that was uh, nice. I like Colin. He he's nice. He's an older he's an older man. I think he's around sixty. But yeah, right now we're just setting up a fire, waiting at the northeast airfield kind of area because there's meant to be a heli drop here as well. It came up in the um, chat about ten minutes ago, so it should be here in a couple minutes. But what we're going to do is we're going to take some uh, beef steak that I got and mix it with the tomato. And if you craft this, uh, you can make stew. And stew doesn't take up very many slots, and it can fill you up a hell of a lot, and it lasts a long time. So, yeah, it gives you this little pot when you make it here, and it's a quarter of the way full. So if you make four of them and combine them all together, I think you should be able to make it into one full pot. Yeah, right, so we can combine these all together and make it into one full pot, and then you stick it on the fire like so. You put a pot inside of the pot, and you just leave it to cook. And yeah, that'll last you a hell of a long time. So now we're just going to wait. Alright, so it should be done. Yeah, it's boiled. Which means it's done. I think, to be fair, 
I'm just going to sit here and eat the whole thing all in one go, because I might as well. Kind of strange that you put a pot inside of a pot to cook it, but, I mean, you can only do so much with mods. Right, the heli crash has spawned, and this looks promising. There's a hell of a lot of fucking zombies down there. So I'm going to make my way down, and I'm going to try and get into one of the buildings, maybe. There's kind of a defensive area where the zombies can't get to me, and I'll be able to take them out quite easily. At least that's the plan. Right, this building should do if all the doors close. And I think, yeah, we can kind of see the heli crash from here. Yeah, pretty much. Right. Oh, for God's sake. For some reason, every now and then, it just doesn't bolt. It doesn't, like, bolt a bullet into the chamber. It leaves them in the mag, so you've got nothing in the chamber. And, like, nine bullets in the mag. And I forgot that these zombies are really fucking strong. Some of these will take two or three body shots to die. Some of them will only take one, but they are military zombies, so they are stronger. Alright, they can't get in here, which is good. And I need to load another mag. Alright, so I just cleared out all of the zombies. And now we're going to go back and check the helicopter. And see if it's... Uh... Ooh, a CBJ. The new... One of the new SMGs. This thing is fucking sick. Yeah, it's got the drum mags as well. It takes 50 round drum mags. It's a 9mm and it's fully automatic and it shoots quick. This thing's ridiculous. And it has a suppressor on it. That's awesome. Alright. Okay, so... Oh, yes. Okay. We have what I was looking for. We can ditch the Lee Enfield now. Get rid of all of that. And take the new gun that we've just found. The Barrett M82. This thing is ridiculous. Alright, let's put a drum mag in this thing. It looks so fucking cool. Oh, and there's mags here as well, so I don't need to buy them. You can't buy the M82 at the trader. You can only sell it for balancing reasons, else everyone would just save up and buy Barrett's and shit. But Holy shit, there's so many mags here. Really hoping I don't get sniped right now. I think once I've grabbed all of this, we're going to head back up to that tree line that I was at and just kind of wait, because people are bound to come for this, for the new gun. So... I've been waiting at this tree line for like 10 minutes, and I just heard someone behind me. Sounds like someone was moving in the bushes, so I'm just going to sit and wait. See if they come around this corner. Oh, fuck. Yeah, there's more shots on the airfield as well. Oh, come on. This thing is not good at range. This thing is made for very short range, fast spraying. I'm going to try and loop around on this guy so he doesn't know exactly where I am. Time to test the Barrett out, though. Where is he? There he is. Oh, fuck. I don't know what gun he's got, so I don't really want him shooting at me at the same time. I don't really want to lose this thing. There he is. Ooh. And he's dead. Yeah, this thing is semi-automatic as well, so it's a fucking beast. But we need to get out of it because we haven't really got a reason to stay. My Hello. Oh, you, you guys me. told me uh, one of your friends died? Yeah, my friend just died. Yeah. We were out there and then he said, I'm dead. And we're like, what? We didn't understand. Was there a gunshot? Yeah. Yes. Yeah, the Mosin shot. Okay, do you know where your friend was? He got shot in the chest. Uh, Don't wait. know. Oh. I'm going to go try and uh, scout this guy out, the guy who's camping the trader. I'm going to yeah, go take him out if I can. Yeah, we have Alright. Thank you. I'll try my best, lads I'm and ladies. Gonna, yes. Alright. Please don't die. Please, I'm begging you. Please. I'll, I'll try yeah, not to. I'll try my best. That was okay. Jamie. She messaged right. me about a uh, person trading the camper. Uh, camping the trader. So we're going to go try and find him. Yeah. Jamie messaged me like five minutes ago saying there's someone camping the... Coming in a trader. 
So I made my way down here and I'm going to try and find the guy who's camping the trader because apparently he's got a sniper and he's just waiting for people to come out the road. He's sniping them and taking their shit and then selling it at the trader. So. But he could be fucking anywhere to be fair. This might take some time. I've checked both tree lines. And I can't see him. I think he's either moved or... Oh, never mind. Ignore what I was just saying. I think we found him. Yeah, we've definitely found our sniper friend. Right, I'm not going to take this shot yet. I'm going to trade my scopes out. Right now I've got the hunting scope on. The new optic called the Falcon Optic has a much higher zoom. So this one zooms in much further, makes it easier to take longer shots. And with the Falcon Optic, you can actually range this gun up to a click and a half, which is 1,500 meters. Yeah, you can see this thing zooms in far when I zoom in. Alright, night night mate. Yeah, he's dead. He ain't coming back from that. Jesus, this gun is fucking incredible. Now I understand why it's so rare. <laughs> I can't, no, oh, I was literally about to say I can't find his body, but we found it. I don't think he's got any friends. They said there was only one gunshot. So, I doubt he's got any friends. What did he have? He had a Winchester. Not a bad little gun. And in case you're wondering, yes, we did make some more stew. Because stew is actually incredibly good. But we are going to ditch it. It's very easy and cheap to make. And it fills you up for a while, so, yeah. Ooh, he had an M4. Nice, I'm going to trade that for the AK. Bring it back to them, see if they want it. Decent. Drop these for them. Wrong button. <laughs> you're you're safe to leave the trader, yeah, guys. Okay, yeah, I'm fine. The guy who's camping the trader, he's dead. Ah, oh, good. Oh, praise. Those are his guns. Lord. You can take them. So there was a guy. Good. We we went outside and then we heard a shot and he said, "I'm dead." And we. We were kidding because we were just shooting up in the air. And then he said, I'm dead. And we ran up and we saw his body. Well, I've gillied myself up with the money that those guys gave me for taking out the uh, trader. And I think I found a base. You just saw the... There's a base there. But the people here, or the person here, I'm not sure how many guys are here. I think there's two of them. They keep running out and running up the hill into the woods, then running back down again. I'm not exactly sure what they're doing. Just slowly moving around, creeping around. I don't know whether they're in or out right now. It seems to be one of them stays at the base, the other one goes. I only ever see one of them leave, come back, then someone dressed differently leaves, come back, then the first guy leaves, comes back. I'm not sure exactly what they're doing. Maybe they've got two bases and they're kind of transferring their loot. Oh, there's one of them. Yeah, he's coming back. What gun has he got? Looks like a scar, maybe? I can't tell from this range. Hmm. Yeah, there he is again. No, that's a different guy this time. He's got a 5.56 gun, I can tell by the suppressor. Might be the new KAC, maybe? Not sure. Right. One of them's just left from here, so I think there's only one inside this building. Um, so not much I need from this tent. I'm not aiming to raid these guys, I'm just aiming to... Uh, Borrow some of their stuff, you could say. Not much I need. Could do with taking some of the food, though. Probably not as all of it, but I don't know. Barrel's empty. Yeah, this half of the base seems to be pretty much empty. 
Right, I'm moving around to the other bit in the kind of broken down barn on the right. There seems to be two bases, literally they've built two separate bases. Yeah, the other base is in this barn here. I'm just going to kind of wait, see if his friend either comes out or goes in, because I've lost track of whether they're coming or going. Ooh. Oh, okay. Oh, is he going back in? Have they switched? No, he's leaving. The other guy hasn't come back yet, which means that no one's at the base at all. They've both outside the base. Yeah, he is actually leaving. Please don't come around this corner. Hmm. Yeah, I've just seen him run up that little bit of the hill. Right, now's the time. Right, no one is in the base at all. So I'm going to try and hacksaw my way in. This is going to take a hell of a lot of time to get through both of these walls, but it might be worth it. You never know. Right, we're in. This is risky. If they come back, I'm fucked. They've got loads of different strips for different camoed ghillie suits. So there's like 20 different ghillie suits now. Hmm. I kind of want to take that M40 sniper. Alright, we've got the sniper. Alright, the 10. Uh, clothing and building supplies, or random shit rather. I don't really need much of that at all. I don't really need any of it actually. I've got food. We have a problem. I just heard someone outside the bush. Yeah, he's, fuck, I'm going to have to kill him. I'm going to have to kill him. Is he dead? Yeah, I think he's dead. Fuck me. I did not expect him to come back that fast. It's only been a couple minutes. Oh, he has a fucking Barrett as well. Jesus Christ, he's going to be upset. These things are not easy to come by. At all. Oh, he's got a Scar as well. I think I'm going to trade the M40 for the Scar. Or the M24 rather for the Scar. Right, it's time to fucking bolt. We need to get out of it. His friend's gonna come back any minute. We need to get out of it. 